Let it rush harder. Rush harder, what does it mean? Rosh Chodesh is the beginning of a new month. Like I told you, if you remember, the new month is a time of complete tshuva, complete tshuva of everyone, of the ones that live in this world and also the ones that live above, of heaven. Oh, what's going on here? Wait. I see you prepared everything for the Havdalah. That's the Abdallah Kasuto style. Yes, amazing. Where is the cup of wine? That's the cup of wine. Nice. And this side, though. We have plastic uh, besamim. And how more besamim. besamim. Good smell, incense. How you call Maybe on those it's written. Yes, Shavuato. It's written. Thanks. Mm. Thanks for sharing in our simcha. No, that's not it. Okay, so besamim, and we have a candle, and we have a cup, and other kind of besamim. Okay, noisy. Hello. How are you? Thank you for being so kind. So, Baruch Hashem, we are here, and we're happy to be here. And uh, Rosh Chodesh, like we said, is the time for complete tshuva. Tshuva for people that live in this world and tshuva from, for the ones that are above. Like that the verse is saying, um, that Hashem is saying to us, Haviu alai kapara. Hashem said to us, told us, Haviu alai kapara. Bring the sacrifice to atone for my mistake, for the so-called sin of Hashem that Hashem exiled His children, He exiled us. We're all dealing with many things in life and we're all facing um, many difficulties and challenges in life and people must be honest about it. People must not push themselves to foreign places, to places that they will feel not comfortable with who they are. Um, some person wrote to me a text last week and he mentioned a spiritual level and actually he meant to talk about his religion um, a bit a function like how much religion he is religious how much religious he is and like I couldn't understand his text like what's the connection between religion to spirituality spirituality is the result of how honest and good and kind and amazing person you are how much good you do in the world that's how spiritual you'll become and religion is something else religion is the the words of the creator that told us the the bible told us the story of creation how hashem made the world and everything and also the obligations that were obligated and there is a lot a lot of of musar of education of how to behave and those are wonderful advice for a person like the desire kadosh is calling all torah mitzvot 18 tabvin good advice to guide the person on how to be a good person a productive person a loyal person so the Torah is coming and teaching the person that it's not allowed to steal and it's not allowed to lie and it's not allowed to kill, to murder, to whatever. And that you must calculate your thoughts and that if you sinned, if you did something wrong, so you must, um, you must uh, do tshuva to confess and to apologize and to respect your parents and to educate your children, whatever. Like All of those guidings are coming to make the person a better person. And spirituality is the result. Like if you really did what you were supposed to do and you committed yourself to the truth, so then the result will be that you will be a very spiritual person. Yes, Shalom Ephraim, I see you behind the cup. How, how do you say Bissamim? Shalom Ephraim. Nachman, do you know how you say Bissamim? You said it right now.
There was a word and it disappeared. Who told it to you? Besamim. Perfume, it's bosem. Besamim, how you call that? I don't know. We are broadcasting now live also on Facebook and also on YouTube and also on many other outlets, I think six. And I cannot see your comments, so even if you're writing for me wonderful comments, I'm not able to see them. And that's it, we're about to start the Avdala. And I want to tell you that we have a huge, huge, huge opportunity in this lifetime to complete our redemption and to bring a complete salvation to, to all of our beloved ones. But it will come only through us, it will come only through our honesty and through our friendship and and how much we will be nice and good to each other and going to help each other in that it depends now it doesn't have to be that the wide world need to change the world will change as a result like if you want to complete a certain way a certain path a certain distance so you must start with one step and then the first step brings you to the next. You cannot think and calculate everything from here to heaven. It's not an option. You can try to do as much as you can based on your ability, on your power, on your knowledge. And then to let the, 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 the way lead you toward the future. So like us, when I decided to do tshuva, to start my tshuva 20 years ago, so was I aware, you think I was thinking about those things, making tours to the US and teaching in English. English is not my mother tongue, it's not my mother language. We never spoke English in our houses. English is a language that I adopted, that I, that I, that I learned while teaching in English before I had the skills at all to teach. There were, there was a person that was in the shiva where I was learning that was not able to learn in, uh, in, uh, in, in Hebrew. And I just sat with him and, and, and tried to translate the speeches to him, the classes that we were learning, that he will be able to hold on and to survive in, 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 in the Holy Land of Israel. And that's how I started talking English to people. I had a regular English like all the Israelis that know to say uh, how much in how much, how are you, how is it going. I still have this uh, yes, this uh, language. Is uh, is our Ima on the way, Shlomo Fine? Yeah. Yes, she's coming. Our fragrant is... Fragrant? Fragrant? Yes. Fragrant, you see another word that I never heard of. Fragrant? I think. You think? Fragrant? Oh, Ima said there is no word to some in English. No word for that in English? Uh, What's maybe. going on with you, American Sorry, guys? I think maybe. So, to make a long story short, but if you write it in the we don't know the path completely. We don't know the road where it will take us, but we should count on the Creator that He is with us and that He is leading us. And we have little Nachman here, making our life sweeter and sweeter every moment. Nachman? Yeah. Oh, wow! Today Israel Nathan told us a nice story, right? But it's too long to tell. Why? You to no, you're not going to start now. Why? Mm, we don't have time for that today. So, after the translator, if you write the Samim, so it's like a Bashamayim in the sky. When you write the word Besamim in in the Google Translator, so it's being written in Hebrew like the word Bashamayim. Bashamayim, it's in the sky, but Besamim is not in the sky. Maybe Besamim is in the sky. Okay, guys, are you ready? Can you hold the camera? Look, hold it in this side, and I'll push this button, and we'll see if it worked. Yes, it worked. Now, slowly, slowly. Are you okay? Are we ready? Ima, can we start? We're good. No, we're not going to die. Rishon, let's see you in the name of the Rishon, and we'll see you in the name of the Rishon.
אל תשמחי או ירתי כי נפלתי, קמתי כיושב בחושך אדוני אור לי. ליהודים הייתה אורה ושמחה וששון ועיקר כן תהיה לנו תמיד. כוס ישוע תסר בשם אדוני יקרא. אנא אדוני הושיע נא. אנא אדוני הושיע נא. אנא אדוני יצליחה נא. אנא אדוני יצליחה נא. הצליחנו, הצלח דרכנו, הצלח לימודנו, הצלח אמונתנו, הצלח שלום ביתנו, הצלח חינוך ילדינו, ושלח ברכה, רווחה והצלחה. בכל מעשה ידינו, כדכתיב יישא ברכה מאת אדוני וצדקה, אלוהי אישנו, סב למרן האדם. חיים. נחמן שודי מת בברכה אמביסקה? לא. ברוך אתה אדוני אלוהינו מלך העולם, בורא פרי הגפן. אמן. ברוך אתה אדוני אלוהינו מלך העולם, בורא מיני בשמים. אמן. ברוך אתה אדוני אלוהינו מלך העולם, בורא בין ישראל לעמים, בין יום השביעי לששת ימי המעשה, ברוך אתה אדוני המבדיל בין קודש לכל. אמן. He brought me a napkin to clean the table. Ima asked you to bring me a napkin that I will be able to do like this. אהבת הרסטר שיש לך